Surviving Martial Law When Things Get Out of Hand, 40 Days and 40 Nights Will Guide the Way Surviving martial law may become a realistic concern as political and economic controversies become increasingly violent and tense. It's a disaster that can be just as devastating as any hurricane or tornado. What's worse, a situation calling for martial law means citizens are causing the destruction themselves with blatant disregard for societal safety. To help people prepare for such scenarios, Absolute Rights is offering an exclusive members-only training course entitled 40 Days and 40 Nights. It's the type of survival guide that can be applied to any number of disasters, and it informs people of all the necessary preparations they need to take to keep themselves and their families out of harm's way. Some may scoff at the possibility of martial law, but it is in fact a true reality. For the past three months, students in Montreal, Quebec, have been fighting tuition hikes so forcefully that the local government has imposed several restrictions on the right to protest. This has led to riot squads beating and tear gassing people indiscriminately, pepper spraying bystanders, and arresting record numbers of Canadians, as reported in the UK's Guardian. Under a draconian law passed by the Quebec government on Friday, said the article, the protesters' very meeting could be considered a criminal act. Law 78, unprecedented in recent Canadian history, is the latest most desperate maneuver of a provisional government that is afraid it has lost control over a conflict that began as a student strike against tuition hikes, but has since spread into a protest movement with wide-ranging social and environmental demands. It's real, it's dangerous, and it's happening to our northern neighbors. Martial law could happen for a variety of reasons. And with the current state of U.S. political concerns, there is no denial that the situation can't be too far away from what's happening in Quebec. Emergency preparedness planning needs to be done to address these real threats, whether people believe they're going to occur or not. Thankfully, 40 Days and 40 Nights will provide people with the steps they can take to fend for themselves and become fully reliant should basic comforts like food, clean water, or electricity supplies be interrupted. The six separate training modules, all located on the members-only 40 Days and 40 Nights webpage, are each devoted to a different survival skill to keep people as ready as they can be. The training course also shares valuable psychological survival techniques, because having a clear mind is just as important as having a supply of food, a camping knife, or a power generator. 40 Days and 40 Nights gives members the three tips to psychological survival as well as the ability to focus on what they can control and stop worrying about what they can't. Absolute Rights is always looking out for personal safety and well-being, which makes 40 Days and 40 Nights a sort of capstone program that gathers as many survival techniques as possible and delivers them in one convenient place. If surviving martial law is something that raises concerns, then 40 Days and 40 Nights will provide all the information to get through it. To learn more about the course, please visit www.40daysofsurvival.com